Mpox has been declared a global emergency by the World Health Organization as a new strain is spreading across parts of Africa at a concerning rate. It's the second time the viral disease has triggered this in the last three years, but this variant has been labeled the most dangerous yet. So exactly how worried should we be? Mpox, which used to be known as monkeypox, spreads through close contact with infected people and it causes flu-like symptoms with these painful pus-filled lesions. Most cases are mild, but it can be deadly. More than 500 people have died in the Democratic Republic of Congo so far this year. Now, there are two main types, clade 1 and clade 2. The difference with this outbreak is this variant is a mutated strain of clade 1, the far more deadly type. Not only that, but it's seeming to spread more easily too. Transmission usually occurs through close physical contact, respiratory droplets and contaminated materials. Those at high risk include close contact of confirmed cases, especially in shared household or care settings. Let's watch out for swollen limb snoops, muscle pain, and a progressive rash. This often begins on the face or genital. Mpox virus is detected and tested in the lab using polymerase chain reactions, which detects the DNA of the virus. It can be conventional based polymerase chain reactions or real-time based polymerase chain reactions depending on the type of the lab and the availability of resources. A sample used is collected from skin rations or a swab from a throat or orophangio. The recent outbreak has spread to 13 African countries so far, and the WHO chief has warned a coordinated international response is essential to stop this outbreak and save lives. Early detection and isolation are key. Let's keep our community safe.